a multi-story residential building is being proposed in the city of Lowell. The development would be built on city-owned property on Riverside Drive on the Flat River. 13 on your side's Carla Byron is in our newsroom. And Carla, you talked with a business owner who's against the project. Yeah, uh, Tonya North, the owner of North Star Antiques, believes the approval of this project was rushed and thinks the property would be better suited for something else. What our river looks like is important. The Line Shack property beside the Flat River currently sits unused. Copper Rock Construction, based in Grand Rapids, is proposing a $4.5 million multi-story residential building, five or six stories tall. On the first floor would be retail or restaurant space. Above that, up to 17 condos or apartment units. I know there's concerns about the height. That is very much an issue. Um, I think the you know whatever comes about here I think needs to be done tastefully and 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 you know with the community in mind. I don't feel our city council has thought this through whatsoever other than I hate to say it but the dollar signs. A business owner just down the street says two previous proposals fell through in two years and a lot of people this time around are concerned about parking. I spend five hundred dollars a month minimum just to bring people into my business and it's a big deal if my people can't find a place to park. The city manager also recognizes parking is an issue as well. They have to meet the parking requirements of the of the area in order to even be able to get approved through this site plan. Um, so there's a lot of there's a lot of there's a lot of steps that actually have to happen before this can even happen. I personally think the downtown needs more um, more businesses than it needs residential. Burns says at the end of the day, he doesn't think this project will be a six story building. They've been really taking to heart what community members have been saying and they're they're making modifications and they, they had said all along they would do that. The project would take a year to complete. On July 25th, City Council entered into a purchase and development agreement with Copper Rock and will vote whether to authorize the sale of property on August 15th.